Hello folks, this has gone spy. The spy will come to you live for Star Wars Stars for Republic, Public, the Sith Lords. Now, from the last episode, uh, the Exile and I went inside of the Academy. Uh, that's where maybe Darth Sion and Kreia is at. Uh, and amongst uh, the Sith that uh, remains in there as bodyguards. But before we went inside, the mirror was wanting to catch up with us, but had a little worse encounterment with an arch nemesis of her, Han Arm, the Berserker Wookiee, and the Abomination uh, that uh, craves for blood, uh, and that's uh, obsession of wanting to kill Mira because of a life dead that she saved his life of on Narshada before she met us years ago. And the battle between these two was, was fierce, and Mira was able to win, just barely, with the skills of a Jedi that she learned from the Exile, and from the same method that she was able to use to defeat Honor the first time back at Fisquist's stronghold. Now, with remote as a new companion, because... I'm not sure if Baydorz is okay because usually Remote has always been in Baydorz's side and the fact that it does a holographic message says there's something wrong of what happened to Baydor. But Baydor has explained the mission parameter and possibly the reason how why Baydor created Remote in the first place. So, uh, right now we're searching for the Shadow Mass Generators that Bador designed during the Mandalorian Wars because I've always wondered why he has no different than any other people that's got his hands dirty uh, of blood. I didn't want to press the matter what exactly did he do, but now that I know, uh, I'm going to make sure that his sin is to be uh, cleansed and his regret to be redeemed by his, by powering up the mass shield generators and destroy Malcor 5, hopefully. We've already taken down finding one or two uh, and back the way uh, we came from, so now we're going to find the remaining two here in this area and the depths of Malcor 5. Now, I'm not exactly sure if the Exile, Mirror, or an I have killed the Storm Beast enough for a remote to avoid the battle, so let's hope that's the case because remote's weapons can't be changed or anything can be changed, in fact. So right now, it's, so right now I'm willing to bed the, the Storm Beast and both areas are destroyed or killed. Enter in sequence for a prime and mass shield generator shadow generator. Shit. I need like uh, this one it needs three more to be activated. I gotta go back to the way I came uh, to activate the other one. <coughs> <sighs> Shit. Sorry allergies. Let's try with this one. Enter in sequence. Antbane surging matching generators. Generator at 73.7% power. Each generator that we've activated seems to be powering up by 25. 
but since the second one that we found, it only went up by like 51%, I think. Or maybe uh, like just 50. And now it's, and now this one at bay, it's like 73%. I really hope that this one is going to be able to put this one into the max. Entering sequence for priming mass shadow generator. Mass shadow generator activated. Search for matching generators. Four found. Generator at 98%. Okay, this will have to do. Mass shell generator sequence powering up. Another message. Pedor. Pedor. You say that. Oh, no, then he's go to. What are you doing? What are you talking about? Bastard! You have no idea what I wish for, Gotum. I should have known uh, that you would do something like this. The Evan Hawk! What's going on? No. No! 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 God, no, please, no. The Evan Hawk. It's gone. God damn it. Kraya! Sion? We'll see about that. Joyo style, frosty, force muty. Force channel on. All of this is my fault. All of it. Mandalorian Wars. What I done. What the Sith have done to the Jedi. To the Order. To why you're doing this. It's all my fault. And I will make sure of it and rectify it. Force Wave!
I need to put a stop to your threat in these bestest folks. This has gone spy. The spy sign off for now.